Welcome to I Learned a Thing in the Bathroom from Dollar Shave Club, where we explain something very complicated in mere minutes to occupy your brain while you shave. In this edition, we'll be answering the question, what will we look like in the future? As explained by someone who sounds smart because he's British. A hundred years from now, while humans won't necessarily look all that different on the outside, our insides may have received a major upgrade. According to Harvard researcher Juan Enrique, humans will need to augment their bodies through a mix of high-tech implants and genetic manipulation if we're to have a hope of living on planets besides Earth. Something, he says, is vital if we're to survive the next major extinction event, which could occur within the next thousand years. Bummer. So what kind of upgrades are we talking about? These changes include things like near-perfect genes capable of resisting diseases such as HIV, lungs and muscles capable of storing more oxygen to help us live more easily in low-oxygen environments, upgraded tissues in our organs to help filter out toxic substances, cells that can repair themselves from the effects of radiation, even widened neurons in our brains to help speed up our reaction times. The end result is a person that, to us, would appear to be almost superhuman. That sounds like a lot to happen. What comes next? Over the course of the next 100,000 years, there are a whole range of possible ways we could mutate and change, depending on where we go and what the environment is like. Even within a 1,000 years, we could see some big alterations. If climate change persists and the Earth heats up, and if we're not able to reverse it, it's likely that humans will gradually evolve to be taller and thinner, a change that will help us to dissipate heat. Skin, too, will darken as an evolutionary response to the increased amount of ultraviolet bombarding the planet. Tall, thin, dark. We're all going to be hotties, basically. Kind of. Although it also gets a little weird. Some of the biggest changes we may see would be in our eyes. There are scientists who believe that our eyes may gradually change colour to red. And not the cornea. It's the whites of the eyes that will slowly mutate this way, due to changes in the ways we process light. If humans manage to escape Earth and explore the galaxy, it's also possible that our eyes will eventually grow in size. As our descendants find themselves increasingly living in low-light environments, their eyes will grow larger to adapt, with some predictions going as far as to say they'll look almost like Disney characters. If they weren't bright red, that'd actually be kind of cute. Well, apart from the sideways blinking thing. The what? One theory is that, as a result of being constantly bombarded by cosmic rays, space-trekking humans may evolve a second inner eyelid, based on the already existing plica semilunaris, that small fold of tissue you can see at the inner corner of your eye. Due to the position of this tissue, your secondary blink would be, well, sideways. Well, that's just awful. We'll also have wider nostrils to help us get more oxygen, and denser hair to help prevent heat loss. And if you're worried that all of this won't fit on our faces, don't be. Our heads are likely to grow in size to accommodate our smarter, faster, larger brains. So we're basically going to be giant, hairy, red-eyed bobbleheads in the future. It's possible. Hmm, that's my fetish. Tune in next time for more I Learned a Thing in the Bathroom. And in the meantime, head to dollarshaveclub.com for more podcasts and a big old pile of grooming products.